Several suspects in custody this morning after a police chase through parts of Aurora and Denver overnight. Yeah, pretty wild story here on the run. Police tell us the suspect shot at officers. Fox 31's Jim Hooley live in Aurora this morning. Jim. Hey, Drew, good morning. We're out here in uh, Montview Boulevard, just on the east side of Tower Road. This is reopened here right now, but uh, just a couple of hours ago, they had to shut down for a long time because there was all kinds of evidence out here in the middle of the roadway, and police found a hand, what appeared to be a handgun sitting right here in the middle of the street. But here's what happened. Here's the latest on the investigation of this wild night over here on the east side. All this started at around, it was about 8 o'clock last night. Police said they first got a report of a car stolen from a, a garage over on East Mexico Avenue over by Chambers. An hour later or so, uh, they spotted of that car in the 23rd and Dayton in Aurora and then they began to follow it but that's when police said the suspects in that stolen car turned around and opened fire on them. Police did not return the fire but that's when the chase began. Officers pursued the suspects through Aurora they went into Denver then they came back here to Aurora and the chase ended right here along Montview when uh, somehow the stolen vehicle got a flat tire. At that point, police said the suspect bailed out. They jumped out of the car and they took off in the neighborhood. Police were able to catch up with one adult and several minors. They have been detained and they recovered several firearms as well, including one that was the, here on the street here just a while ago. One suspect was taken to the hospital. They had minor injuries, they say, but uh, no officers injured. Despite the gunfire last night, the chase, no officers injured whatsoever. That is the good news. Monview is now reopened here once again, and that's the good news as well. But let me tell you, it was a crazy night. And unfortunately, despite all the gunfire last night, and it looked like they were picking up some shell casings perhaps here as well with that firearm they found here in the street. Again, no officers injured. Live here in Aurora this morning, I'm Jim Hooley. Fox 31. What a wild story there. Yeah. Thankfully, no officers were injured. Thank you, Jim.